How you doing guys? Uh, we're here to talk about um, the GoPro. We're going to be doing a couple of videos on that. Um, previously, we also did some videos on the Canon T3i DSLR using the Pixar Profile Style, uh, Technicolor Cine Style. Um, and I found out a little bit later that GoPro partnered with Technicolor on using their Cine Style in their newly or newer developed ProTune settings within <clears throat> the GoPro series. And it actually basically uh, does several things. If you do, uh, depending on what camera you have as well, because it, a lot of this depends on the processor. Um, now I do have the GoPro Hero 3 Silver Edition. So keep that in mind. Um, the bit rates and everything else will all depend on which type you have. And the ProTune setting is available for GoPro Hero 2 all the way up to uh, Hero 4 series. And it does several things for you. For one thing, it boosts up the, uh, the bit rate. Normally, if you do around uh, 1080p, uh, 30 frames a second, it's roughly, depending on the series, uh, 15 megabits per second. It goes all the way up to 45 megabits per second. So you're going to get a lot more uh, video information to post-edit. And it uses a flat picture profile instead of default uh, settings within GoPro. So you're going to get very flat, desaturated, high dynamic range than you could ever could with just using the ProTune default settings. Okay, here we are uh, on our uh, GoPro camera. We're going to uh, show you where ProTune is. And we're going to go to the little wrench in the lower right hand side. And uh, go to capture settings. And uh, we're going to go ahead and choose ProTune. Now, it all depends on the type of camera you have uh, from GoPro 2 all the way to uh, the Hero 4. Um, what settings you have. Uh, my version, I do have the GoPro Hero 3 Silver Edition. Uh, if you have the Black Edition or some of the other ones, you're going to get uh, as many as five, I believe, se uh, individual settings. And we're going to go ahead and select Camera Raw uh, on white balance because we want to get as uh, best quality as we can. There we go. We're set up to do uh, ProTune right now. Okay, uh, we went ahead and downloaded uh, the footage from the GoPro camera into Final Cut Pro 10. Uh, two test clips that we did. One with uh, just normal settings, default settings in GoPro, and then... One using ProTune right here. Um, so we're going to go ahead and try the LUT utility uh, to see how well it works with GoTo Pro, uh, GoPro Tune footage. And supposedly it also uses the Technicolor Cine Style uh, picture style as well. Um, and so let's go ahead and go to LUT utility and we're going to apply the Cine style S curve, just like our uh, Canon D DSLR footage we uh, did, which seems to work quite well. Here we uh, have the LUT applied, Cine style S curve. And uh, now we're going to go to the uh, color correction of uh, everything. Okay, uh, you can also use GoPro Studio to um, edit and, and everything else to it in for your ProTune clips uh, for GoPro, your GoPro camera. Uh, it's a little bit different, and it does it automatically. And uh, we're going to take this and put it in the conversion list. You have to convert it first. And here, here is the uh, clip right here. As you can see, it's very desaturated exposures uh, way up there. So we're going to convert it, and you're going to see once uh, what it looks like once it's finished. the uh, GoPro uh, clip has been converted so we're going to go to step two the editing process and as you can see here it has now been everything's been automatically done uh, color correction and um, the clip it looks like it may be a bit too much so um, it'll allow you to go here and tweak it as needed right here I wish you could just let you do uh, add it if 
if and when necessary, but it just automatically does it. Um, so we may have to actually increase it a little bit. Uh, just like so. And uh, it's a little confusing since it does it automatically because they do have this presets and one happens to be the uh, Pro Tune. So I'm, I don't know if, if it automatically adds that preset there for you, uh, I guess. But uh, so that's another way you can automatically adjust your uh, Pro Tune GoPro clip.